Hi everyone, it's me Darlene. I am sitting in front of Hannaford. I've already been in the store. I wanted to take you guys out with me so I could do a quick parking lot vlog. So I'm guaranteed to at least have something for video tonight. I got up kind of late and I'm off to a very late start and it is already 3.16 p.m. Eastern Time and it is 35 degrees. Yes, 35 degrees. I certainly could have benefited by a light sweatshirt, but I would have been hot in the store with that. So why bother to put it on just to get from here to there and back? The people in front of me are going to be leaving and I'll be able to pull forward. I will be showing you everything that I bought today because I don't really have too much to chat with you about. But first, I want to give a big shout out to Patty who recognized me in the store. She is a peanut gallery member and she happens to live by Rogers. And I'm familiar with her name because she says she comments like when I'm at Rogers parking lot saying that she lives around there. So it was very nice to meet you, Patty. I hope I did a good job presenting myself. I worry so much because of my social anxiety, but I gotta tell ya, not having carbs in my system has really helped that a lot. I think I did an okay job. I didn't, like, cry after. <laughs> I feel bad because I know people are afraid to approach me when they see me because they know what a nutcase I am. Man doesn't know why I'm talking with my hands. Just go! I want the parking space ahead of me! Go, please! Pretty please! I have to get ready. Start the car. Too much noise. And they think I'm leaving and I'm going to pretend I'm doing something else. Let me pretend. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. You know I'm never doing that high part. Okay. Why am I so stressed out that they're taking so long? I want them out of here. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Okay, that was enough pretending. I can't think right now, so let's just wait a second. I'm all panicked that I'm not going to get the space ahead of me. He's moving. Let's go. Oh, my God. So happy. Wicked excite. Bye-bye. Okay. Hi, Patty. Nice to meet you. You know, I used to meet a lot of people in my Deals by Darlene days because all the locals who followed my blog for shopping at Shaw's and stuff. But now that I stopped doing that, I don't get as many people saying hi to me. And I do think a lot of that is because I have showed my true colors and expressed how stressed I can get. But it's getting better. I like that. Saw my dentist couple weeks ago. I didn't pass out. I was like, I had Sandy with me. I was like, Sandy, I did okay. You know? <laughs> so, and I even got a nice hug from Patty. I like hugs. I'm a hugger. So if you do approach me, be ready to get hugged. Unless I am like a complete sweat ball. I don't expect you to hug that. I think I've talked enough about that. So let me tell you what else, nothing else. I went in, I bought a lot of stuff because I bought some extra things for my mommy. I really should have done cooking for freezing today, but I think I can get away with that until next week. I need to clean my freezer again. Let's start with the easy things. I got a gallon of Hannaford milk and let's see what the price of this is. Oh, I know it's usually more than Rogers, but maybe not. I think that they're pretty comparable to Rogers. My glasses are all fogged up. Where the heck is it? $3.79. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now we'll start with down here. I got peanuts so we can remain the peanut gallery. And it has meaning still. Okay, those of you who have been with me for a while, you know I used to eat tons and tons of peanuts. And now I just got a smaller bag strictly for my mama's squirrels. I got my mother, oh, the bag of peanuts was $2.99. It's a pound and a half bag. Ketchup for my mother, and this is 99 cents. Steak for me, I got three of these babies. It is a boneless chuck braising steak, 
and I could have also got it in roast form, but I just recently bought roasts, and I like steaks like this because even though I might just slice that thin and fry it, it's a way for me to take out some beef out of the freezer without having to have a whole roast if I don't want. This was on sale for $2.49 a pound, and nice marbling in there. Oh, I bought four of them. Two, three, four. And they were all in around like $3.50 to like $4.25. I got my mother a bag of white potatoes. I do believe these are Maine potatoes. This is a five pound bag. And it was $2.99. Got my mother a little thing of mustard because she's all out. I got her the equivalent of Little Debbie Swiss Rolls. Only mine are the Hannaford brand. Can't remember who, if it's Drake's or Hostess or whoever makes regular Swiss rolls, but this was only $1.29 for the box. And there's 12. There's six twin packs inside. My mother loves those. I also got her, this isn't something I get her too often, but they're donut sticks. And what it is about them is they're very um, glazed and not flaky. I don't know how to describe them. Let's put it this way. If these were chocolate, she would be in love. She used to always get what we used to call chocolate crawlers at Dunkin' Donuts. Crawlers were a big thing for a long time. They were like a donut stick, but a little twisted. Then Dunkin' Donuts switched to chocolate sticks, and I don't know if they even make those anymore now. I'm not sure. This is like the same texture. She'll love it. She can always add some jelly on them if she wants. She's been saying, I've never tried apple cider. And I'm like, yes, mom, in your lifetime, you've had apple cider. My goodness. I said, well, I will get you a little apple cider if uh, I come across some. And I saw some today. So this is Northland apples. Oh, the donut sticks were, I also think, 129. This is Northland apples, sweet main cider, pure sweet main cider. She always said, your father wouldn't let me drink it because he said I'd get drunk. I'm like, Mom, that's hard cider. Big difference. <laughs> My mother needs to get drunk, I think. <laughs> okay, so this little bottle, which is 12 fluid ounces, was $1.29. So that's a good way for her to get some. Oh, and I think the meat man talked about me today. The same meat man that I said was standing near me and in my way the other time I was here, remember? It was like with the big tray of shelves of meat. I was like, okay, I feel like I'm in his way. So I moved and then he followed me with meat and stood by me again. He is also the one that caught me with my camera once upon a time, which is why I'm not allowed to bring the camera here. He, um came up to me one time and I had the camera and I had just put it down and I looked at him and he just, you know, looks at me and goes, can I help you with anything? I was like, are you approaching me because I have a camera? No, no, I didn't even know. I didn't even know that. Well, he knew it and I called him on it later. And uh, so today I'm like walking toward the meat and I see him and another meat guy and I like kind of like just turned my head and I could see through that corner of my eye this way that he goes over and talks to the other guy. The other guy turns around and looks right at me and I said, are you guys talking about me? And he goes, oh, no, no. I was just wondering why that other guy moved my car or whatever. Whatever! Now, yes, this could be my imagination, but it's kind of odd that he tells somebody something in a whispering kind of format gently in the other dude's ear, and then the other dude turns around and looks at me, directly at me. Me thinks me was talked about. <laughs> I bet you Hannaford still hates that I even do parking lot vlogs here. I really think they do. I just think they do. They're not friendly with my camera, and I don't think they like it out here either. But the most they could do is tell me, Darlene, we'd rather that you don't shop here. And in that case, I would say, okay, I won't shop here, but instead I'll just come in the parking lot and do horrific videos about their customers. <laughs> okay, bananas for my mother. 49 cents a pound. Some little plum Roma tomatoes for my mother, 99 cents a pound. A green pepper for my mother, also 99 cents a pound. Likes green peppers in her sandwiches. I got my hot, oh, that's 
scared me. I thought at first it said sweet. Hot Italian sausage. It is $2.99 a pound. I paid a $3. Now the other day I bought my mother a Pepperidge Farm swirl bread and it was cinnamon brown sugar flavor. She absolutely loved it. So I told her I would buy her other flavors for her to try. So this one is caramel or caramel, however you say it. Apple. Where does it say? Ah. Now see the way it's spelled? To me that should be pronounced caramel. Three syllables, not caramel. So I'm going to say caramel apple. That is the end of your English lesson for today. All this came up to a grand total of $50.51. So, I don't have too much else to talk about. I just wanted to mention that I'm having a lot of fun with the polls. I will be doing more of them. The fleece blanket prints for the robe, which I really want to try to make this week, it's been neck and neck for quite a while, but the geometric seems to have a lead that is lasting. So, and I'm kind of glad about that because I'm very curious to see how that will look as a whole robe. I can imagine what all zebra looks like, but that print I really can't imagine. So I think it will be nice. And then, of course, the new drawings, the man is way in the lead, or as Sharon Wise would say, hi Sharon, the penis man is ahead. Ha! Ah, I thought that was cute. So I will be going to dig those drawings out of my cellar, hopefully today. And we'll also try to do that video this week. We know that the man is winning. The only reason I would have liked to do the woman first is because after the man, I think any woman drawing is going to be pretty boring, don't you? But we'll see. Maybe I'll just do those nudies in one video, show you the dude first, and then his partner after. Okay guys, I'm gonna go because I want to just eat for one thing and uh, just see what else I want to do. I'm anxious to go get the artwork and go through that stuff. So I will talk to you later. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, all that stuff. And remember, if you are a YouTube content creator, I want you in my new group, Mixed Nuts, where we network and share our videos and, more importantly, our ideas. So I would love to have you in there. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!